exacting and wholesome team effort. We do this for fun. We do this for free. We, we do this for you. My friends, you're in luck. Because tonight you are about to experience a story like no other. A puzzle. A mystery. A suspenseful tale of someone who is trying to remember something. Someone who needs your help. Characters in a story are filled with the love that we give them. And they give back to us, do they not? But do we owe them everything that they are? Do we give them everything that they are owed? Or perhaps, do they have the right to be owed anything? Do they even have the right to live, if they are characters in our head? They're only alive as long as we are thinking about them. Perhaps we're no different. My friend's story tour is a puzzle with multiple endings, and they can be reached based on the group's actions. You must all talk and work together during the story. Use both your eyes and ears to see what's really going on here. I will not be your tour guide of this evening. That honor will go to the man of many names the most talented voice actor of VR Travelers, the legend himself, the one, the only, Trey Jim. Trey Jim, <laughs> please merge with the VR Travelers. Right. <laughs> oh, God. That's a new thing. That's oh, an Fusion <laughs> Boy, this is a throwback. I love you, Trey Jim. Interesting. The mega, mega sheen. Ultra sheen. <laughs> Trey Jim. Fusion is successful. <laughs> you probably don't to say that in public, Shane. <laughs> <laughs> Well, my friends, welcome. Please, gather around and listen carefully. My name is Trajim, and I will be your tour guide for tonight's event. It's nice to meet you, though many of us have already met. As one of the tour guides of VR Travelers, I enjoy telling stories to you, and I enjoy seeing you try to figure them out. Tonight, we will journey to a place which some of you have known of for quite some time. Once there, we will follow the tale of the agent. The instance will be invite plus. So, please, friends, make sure you are friends with others who are going to the instance. This way, if you have trouble joining, or if you get kicked for any reason, you can send an invite request and come back. You are all more than welcome to send a friend request to myself. Or Sheen behind me. Mm -hmm. And now, my friends, without further ado, let us travel together to the Grey City. Those in front of me, please. Kindly stand aside. I will drop a portal. Please wait for my signal before entering the portal.
My friends, the portal is stable. I will see you on the other side. Agent like it's good to be agent, my friend. I hope you enjoy tonight's event. Hi. I only remember show. this because I saw a clip of uh, oh my god, of uh, <laughs> I wish I had that. <laughs> <laughs> right right in your face. Also enjoying driving. some drinks this morning, so it'll definitely add to the experience. <laughs> Some drinks. I, love yeah, I don't know how to do it, but that's like doing just... that was freaking awesome. It's so oh, yeah. I'm gonna Especially guess with all the head. We'll definitely so it's so good. 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 It's so good.
and possibly approved. collaborating sometime approved. in the future. Please feel welcome right. to talk to me in Discord and yes, my friends, okay. please get your gather Discord. with the rest of the group. You'll see me in there. I'm one of the tour guides. Okay, okay. I'll add you. Okay, okay, okay. Very awesome. Wait, where did... Oh, what? Hmm? He said right here, and then he moved on. I don't I'm know either. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good. I can't be Is anybody waiting on a friend to join? We are missing one head. Hey, we're doing a, an Let me see. Thing, just kind of. I know it has. I know Geo is supposedly, see. according to the friends menu, at least he's supposed to be on his way here, but he hasn't join, arrived yet. Having trouble. <gasps> Tell him to mute and unmute me because I'm right next to him. Oh. Um, yeah. No. Block and unblock. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, oh, yeah, I muted and unmuted you. And I, and oh. I, you just, I just appeared. I hate that look. I hate it. Mm. I've been here the whole time. But, yeah, this is well, kind of an adventure glitch. thing, so. It's the bug. Okay. You'll like it. Ah, uh, the love worst it. bug well, so much, shed on So <laughs> much for Gandalf. I guess this train will pass. What? 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 I said I'm just What'd playing my D and D game kind of just passively because I'm just like I don't want to be in it right now. Not okay. Now. Yeah, you, you gotta. You're gonna have to like super pay attention to this one. So. My friends. I'll, I'll, I'll try my, best. my friends, your attention, please. Thank you for your patience as we wait for fellow friends and travelers to arrive. I believe we are ready to begin. Friends, make sure you have the world music turned up to a comfortable level. And now, the story begins. Stepping off a late night train with shards of glass in my hair. A graze from a bullet on my left arm. And a limp from the fall. I bet you're wondering how I ended up like this. Well, let's just say that I learned some things. I found some truths they didn't want me to find. And in all their wisdom, they decided to try and silence me. And they tried to silence the wrong man. You see, I got away from their first attempt with a few scrapes and bruises. But now, ah... Uh, News reports. Breaking news. Cyber terrorist attacks. Uh, apparently hasn't been identified yet. Well, that's typical. Justifies lethal force by the lightheads. Well, it's gonna be a hell of a night. It's a good thing I left my PDA behind. Good luck tracking me now.
in case it ain't obvious. I'm an agent, a hitman, for the director of District 54A of the Gray City, under an organization that brands itself as the PSO. My job is to target criminals who are either too rich or too powerful to take down using the law. Well, that was my job. Now, uh, now I'd like to have a, a little talk with the director. Just him and me. Have you ever woken up in the morning from a vivid dream and you expect it to fade into nothing like all dreams do? But as the hours tick by, you realize you weren't dreaming. They're memories. They feel like memories. memories of things you've never done, memories of seeing the sun, memories of having a woman safe in your arms, memories of a child calling you dad. They feel so real, so convincing. And then you realize I know what they did to me. My brain isn't all mine. My brain is a machine. Artificial. I'm a cyborg. Either they put this brain in me, or I had it the whole time, and they hacked it. Either way, they stole who I was, who I am, away from me. Stole my life. Stole my family. Stole the people that I love. And, and I ain't letting nobody get away with this. Me and the director. We're going to have a real good talk. And he's going to talk. Or he's going to find out just what kind of machine he's created. All right, let's get to work. Got to lay low. Got to be careful who I talk to. And... Gotta avoid identifying myself. Thankfully, things are a little chaotic here. Seems like the small quake that happened during the train ride shook things up a little. There's workers about, so shouldn't be too hard to blend into the crowds here. But they're gonna be looking for me. So I gotta keep moving. All right. Ticket scanners. This way. Let the noise commence. <laughs> In theater, scanning mechanisms. That's pretty cool, right? Man, that tremor really did a number on this place. Well, you know what they say. They say the world is dying. And we killed it. You know what I say? I say... 
There's only one thing I give a damn about, and it ain't the world. I can see a payphone off the steps to the arcade, uh, but I see some cameras too. I gotta lay low. At least the sound from the arcade should drown out my voice. Target isn't found. Friends, are you there? The group has moved. Oh, my apologies. Deadly poison. Are you AFK? I love the lighting in here, it's pretty cool. Look at all those fools. Young and old. Gambling their lives away. Hypnotized by the lights. Sounds. Colors. And it's like... Them machines have stolen a piece of their souls. Huh. Guess I know how that feels. All right, now. Who to call? Think. Think. I got it. I've got a tech friend who worked for PSO some years back. He's broken away now, but uh, he's the kind of guy obsessed with security. Lives alone. Stays online, covers his tracks. Real mysterious. But I need someone with inside knowledge. And an old fashioned payphone it is the perfect opportunity. Come on, come on, pick up. Ah, uh, hey. Hello? Who's this? It's me. Listen. I need to know what's going on. What code have they got on me? Ah, I thought you might contact me. Oh, I already checked. Yeah, you got a code six on you, mate. Ah, damn. That ain't good. Oh, where are you right now? What are you doing? I'm just at the station. You know, the one below PSO headquarters. What? What? Mate, you're crazy. What are you doing there? Well, I'm going to have a friendly little chat with the director. I see. Uh, all right, listen. I got an idea. I know a way you can get past security, but you'll have to get your hands dirty. It'll be just like the old days. Fine by me. What's the idea? You know how one of my favorite hobbies is uh, spying on security systems? Well, I just happen to know that there's someone who PSO is expecting to visit in the same station as you. He's in the Senator's Lounge. If you can draw him away from the public eye, perhaps you could... Uh, Borrow his identity. You know, permanently. Right. Interesting plan. But, uh, what's the catch? What about bodyguards? He won't have any. He's travelling covertly. He even drove himself here. He's not the kind of man to draw attention to himself, so nobody but the higher-ups should recognise the ideas, even in the wrong hands. As long as you have his identification, you'll be allowed through security, 
no questions asked. That should be simple enough for you, being a fancy pants agent. Uh, all right, I guess that's my only option. Great. Just one question. What the hell happened? Uh, it's kind of a long story. I'll tell you next time I see you. There should be an alley across the street from here, outside. Uh, all right, meet me in the alley when you're ready. Good luck. Senator's Lounge, huh? All right, straighten up. Let's see. Should be just round the corner. Time to get moving. It's pretty neat, right? Oh. Don't be afraid to talk while we walk. You all need to figure out what's yeah, really going on. Someone mentioned his butter. No. Yeah, there's... Ah. Wait, what do you mean? What are you talking about? Oh, the phone call was smooth oh, as yeah. butter, folks. Really Nothing is wrong. I'm not doing that joke again. Yes. No, Sheen. Yes. No, please. Yes. Sheen, what were you talking about? I don't have any more. Be real with me. Lorik no. demands it. Sheen, what were you talking about? Lorik no. demands it. going on? No. So no, 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 we're not doing That's butter gag again. So, for now, fine. <laughs> Although, I have to admit, it was Trajan who instigated it. So. All right. Well, there's only two people here. One sitting on the couch. The other. Wait, did I just restart my computer? There's a man. <laughs> I knew it. Standing in the corner we go. of the room. So I'll get over here. He's... he's not supposed to be here. What's he doing here? He's not supposed to... Well, you know what they say. The world is dying, and we killed it. Yeah, you got a code six on you, mate. I only heard something about a class seven entity. The lecturer reaches the class seven <laughs> dormitory building. Oh no. You're not okay. gonna believe this. I think I found its origin. There was a poison leak on the seventh floor. We were connected to a data line for the first years of wait, this thing isn't gold, it's Nice to see you again, travelers. I just thought I would stop by and remind you all who is in control. Lucian, don't speak. <laughs> I also came yeah. out to warn you of something. You see, some of you know who I am, some of you don't. Don't worry. We'll become very acquainted. 
over time. My warning for you is this. Some of you here right now are trying to solve this little puzzle, this tale which the tour guide selected for you for some reason. And others of you have sabotaged the efforts of the otherwise wholesome little community. This tour will remain unsolvable. For now, at least. Well, apologies for the interruption. I'll let you all get back to your little story then. But I'll see you on the next tour. And the next one. And the next one. And the next one. Okay. Bye, Mr. Gorner. Thanks for showing up today. <laughs> Only one person here. Looks like a pushover. All right, let's put on a voice. Excuse me, sir. There is a problem with your vehicle. Please come with me to the parking sector. Excuse me, and who might you be? I can explain on the way, sir. In the meantime, your vehicle is being used as a trampoline by some kids. You might want to move swiftly, sir. The police are on their way. A trampoline, you say? Show me immediately. Of course, sir. Right this way, sir. What a gullible fool. I like it that he pointed you out, Lucian. Which one? Oh, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Lucian's the, the, Lucian the first one to always respond. Which means he <laughs> knows us a lot better than we think. Well, he is a common traveler here. I don't think it's anything out of the ordinary. It's concerning. <sighs> yes. Don't you worry your little head. He's actually addressed us by name, though. Hmm. Much to unpack. Interesting encounter. Indeed. And he said that the, the tour is unsolvable now. For this time, already. You think he's... Uh, he's it doesn't mean he won't Why try, right? Lie about right. It? This is perfect. Looks like there ain't gonna be no witnesses. I always did feel cozy in the shadows. This guy, though... Uh, Looks like he's about to piss himself. Poor fool doesn't know what he's in for. Well, what's the meaning of this? This isn't the way to the... God! <laughs> ah, all right. That's him sorted. Now, let's see. What's he got on him? Coat? Briefcase. Huh. Nice hat. And his identification. This'll come in mighty handy. Hmm. Sort of resembles me, too. All right, seems like nobody heard that. Let's take a quick look in this here briefcase. He seems like a shareholder of PSO. And what's this say? Project Grandfather. Mm, don't mean much to me. I gotta keep moving. Let's see if security lets me through with this little gem.
<sighs> Did he say little Jim? Sound like he said yeah. little Jim. <laughs> By the way, yeah. what are the series of numbers for? Six, seven, mm -hmm. seven. Hey, which numbers did he say again? Six, seven, seven. Hmm. I think our tour guy is lost. <laughs> never. What, no, never sea, there's a sea of bodies. I mean, anyone would find well, I mean, bodies around dead for bodies. a crowd of like 25 people. I don't believe there's anything to worry about. 37 to be more exact. Don't worry, he never goes the wrong way. Nope, never. Not an interesting place. Always intentional. He's too clever. I got, I got this. Wait a minute. I'll be right back. I went up to the projecting me wall. Hello, would you like to order a make waffle? Man, this place. Place really got shaken up. All right, I'm next. Time to get fancy. Put on another voice. Good evening, sir. May I please see some identification? Well, of course, you go. Thank you. One moment, please. Everything checks out, sir. Thank you. Have a nice day. Uh, sir, one more thing. Due to recent events, we are performing bioscans on randomly selected individuals. Please, step aside so our attendant can perform the scan. Bioscan? What the hell is she talking about? Uh, this must be about the uh, cyber terrorist thing. I appreciate that, but can you randomly select the next individual? I was already delayed by the earthquake, and the director of PSO is expecting me. I don't want to make him wait any longer. Ah, there it is. Fear in the eyes. Gotcha. The uh, director, of course, sir. I shall randomly select the next individual. Please enjoy the rest of your evening. That was a close one. So many cameras, too. So many eyes. I don't like this. Well, the exit is just around the corner. Let's go see my insider. It's been... Quite a while. I'm so tempted to say at this time. Well, but don't you say oh, it. Don't God. think it. Don't think it, don't say it. Oh, I'm thinking the B word, it's forbidden. Don't think it, don't think it, don't say it. Monkey. Monkey, monkey. yes, Turn monkey it. is fine to think and say. Don't spread it. But here is the bakery. You know what? We only spread our jokes so thin. Really on bread. What? <sighs> Yeah, that shit's good. Lucian, what's good on bread? Who said the B word? Lucian, what are you, what are you, what are you, what are you gonna say? They have not improved in car oh, technology. No, <laughs> Music is tense. You know what that means. Kick. You don't have to be tense, you can relax your shoulders. 
by the music that there is. Neon lights on buildings black as midnight. So many words that don't mean nothing. So much noise for the mind. Can't even hear your own thoughts. It's no wonder people are going crazy these days. Don't even know who they are no more. Wait, I see a couple of people roaming the streets. I don't want to draw attention to myself. Well, if they see me, I should put on an act. Try to talk my way out of it. As long as I don't say or do anything out of the ordinary, I should be fine. There should be enough alleys and shadows around here to sneak past them to the other side of the street. My friends, please listen carefully. You have a quest to complete. The rules are as follows. Your destination is across the street, in the back left corner, near a roller door. I will be waiting for you there. But on your way there, you must choose one of the following to count. Different magazine titles, or potted plants. What you choose to count is up to you, but make sure you count one of them as you may be personally asked for your count at the end of the quest. Once this task is done, please make your way to the rendezvous point mentioned. Additionally, there are people roaming around here that the agent does not wish to be disturbed by. They may be policemen, security officers, military personnel, or even simple nosy citizens. They will be carrying flashlights. Regardless, try not to act suspicious around them. Act natural. If you are approached by these figures, you may be questioned. Do your best to talk your way out of trouble. And if you see a friend in trouble, help them out. If you fail to convince them once you are confronted, they will issue you a warning. And, my friends, quests can influence the outcome of the tour. Before going anywhere, please make sure you have the avatars of today's guards, Falcon and Alazu, fully enabled. They should be changing into their avatars now. Wait. Hmm? My friends, can you all see Falcon and Alizu? Falcon and Alizu. You all need to show their avatars. Well, in peace, please, please take your positions. My friends, you have ten minutes, and no longer, to complete this quest. Mm. Your mm. time begins now. Art, do you want to split up your... Inferior <laughs> camera and models. Um, what, what did we count we last this time? Direction. I don't know. I don't know. I remember. I remember. I think it was... Last time we counted potted plants. Maybe magazines, but... I don't... I don't have no real system to keep track of this. How do you... Shit. Shit. Right. People. Oh my god. Look at all those chickens. Hey, Pebble player, hey? Okay? Scanning technique. Better watch your way. Fuck you, Pebble just right at the door. Trouble? There's all these people pouring out of them. Mm -hmm. Thunder, mm -hmm. Thunder. 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 So my next, another robot cameraman following them with a gun. Something, Nick. 
There's some magazine covers over there. You might want to look at them. Sewers. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Yo, Lucian. What's up? Uh, come over here for a sec. Mm -hmm. Two plants. Interesting. Where's a fairly private place? Excuse me. Hey! I hey. saw you up there. Get out here. Now! Nice tea. Get out. Get down here. Uh, cash down. Yeah, get down here. Oh, hello. I just figured out the map. Crawling up in there. Lucian walking up to the man in the corner, just insta angry eyes. Hmm. Fuck! I forgot the number I was at counting. I was only to four. Sorry. Yeah, I think I counted more than that, but I'm not sure. Do one of the uh. Scary. Oh, if the oh, statement is true, then there is something very early in the tour we could do differently. But what I don't see is how it would be different. We weren't given an option at that point yet, though, were we? Yeah, we're not even given. Progressing. But technically, apparently there has been precedent of other things we do outside of just obvious choices that can affect it, like where we're standing and the like. I'm almost curious if VR so there could travelers be something weird that we just aren't doing. I almost think it's something connected to VR travelers, or not just just like how we're standing. I'm sure that they're not going to hold that against you. Yeah, mm -hmm. maybe like it's other things outside of just this one. Yeah, maybe like rendezvous lore or something. I don't know. That might give us a hint onto what we need to do. I need to walk over to yeah, you. How about that we can't that solve this one because they don't have any other tours at the moment. Well, like, honestly, don't, bo don't worry about it. He, the man in the corner was probably lying at it, just wants to, just wants to, just felt like a little pissy for some reason. Who knows? Either way, I wouldn't worry about it. And it's completely I never wanted to be more worried about it. Possibility. Look, you should be more worried about the fact that he showed up than the fact that what he said. I'm already worried that he, because of the fact that he showed up in the first place, he didn't have much for Raiders. I wouldn't focus on what he said, though. Yeah, usually he's just mentioned. Uh, same. Not too much going on. Um, Actually, I just got back from the trip, so a little bit of a jet lag, so why not, uh... Uh, Small. off to uh, uh, Tennessee. By the way, he's only showed up one time. Uh, the way, he's only showed up one other time before. Are they like uh, Nashville or are they like more like the remote? I am not going to try and click my heels. I am uh, more remote. I'm on a hard, slippery hardwood uh, floor. Jacksonville, so I think, is the like largest city nearby. Well, like, I think it's kind of, I'm going to finally it's update your PIA. Your, uh, about the same your distance away profile. from. I'm going to come over to the mute. They're actually going to take a picture. That's still pretty fun. Oh, wait, you have full I got a buddy who lives out in Tennessee now and with his family. Awesome. Oh, uh, nice. Kind of like a new area, though. Very awesome. Yeah. Welcome to the That's club. been a bit hot and humid out there, so. It's not great around this time of year, but. Uh... Yeah. 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 Oh, practice That's always a nice change of scenery. Yep. Did you guys go out and do anything? I guarantee it won't work. Uh, 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 mostly just, uh, time to spend time since to break once I go we're out in totally different states. Gotcha. And uh, with the travel oh, restrictions, no, no, no. haven't had a chance oh, to visit them in <laughs> over a year. Oh, yeah, I definitely feel you on that. Oh no, Nick's flat. <laughs> oh yeah. Geo, geo, it's terrible. Do you have any idea? Oh yeah, you said you had jet lag, so yeah, you definitely will. What? Nick's flat. Shouldn't have been too bad. I feel like 
That mode should be like yeah, three, I think four hours. Protag is talking to you. You're far away from tension. Oh, oh yeah, Protag, what is it? Oh, there's two. Yeah, it was around yeah. four hours. Yeah. Was, uh, yeah, I believe yeah. so. Mask on the whole time, so but... Wait, it's... Nothing yeah, terrible like... to put up with. What are you trying to do? Hey. You got that? Um, good? Hey, uh, what was the joke? Anybody have them? Everybody know my joke. Yep. Scott. Fully vaccinated. Yeah, full uh, vaccinated. Uh, oh. We should hit full... Alright. Uh, we got uh, the first thing to Like, the day before I flew out. Are you trying to hit that knee? Well, that's good. And then you shouldn't really have to worry about that. Yeah, I'm not, I, I'd have to bend down a bit low and I don't feel like doing that. Yeah, that's, it's like, that's not happening. Happy to hit that. It's a... Uh, I'm getting up now, hold up. Right. A little more... Yeah, I'm gonna go up now. Freedom to do things outside yeah, of the house. Yeah, and it gives you peace of mind, too. Yeah, from personally, I have to leave for some reason. Because I don't... I just can't be around my life. Yeah, everyone's done. Oh, a little bit faster. He has to mute and so, he, Nick has to uh, mute and unmute him. Uh, and some people if you actually go and do you barely mute the crowd. Uh, it's a bug. You just had a, yeah. someone, the people uh, I was yeah. lucky enough to have a, you and then effectively a yeah. office job. I can yeah. do like 99% of it from home. I would jump without so. oh, yeah. being loud and obnoxious for the people right. I live with. Well. Happy to remain. Gamefully employed throughout the whole. Just tolerate uh, my issues. insanity. Yeah, I can't mute yeah, them. Yeah, dude. Quite a few people. I know. Just he did. Friends list. Let's open to the next dimension. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I want to do that next. Yeah. That flows. It's been hard. <laughs> Leon just so. went. I must go. My people need me. So in that case, you know, I didn't. Well, actually, I went to Yagi, but yeah. Happy with that. I same same energy. Gamefully employed, so it's not like I need it. I don't know if I actually do download the thing or I You're gonna need to download the advanced settings. Oh, it looks like I've got a bug. I don't see a geo. So remember what I mentioned earlier? Okay, I can run you through it if you want on your table. Maybe when we're back to the He has to mute and unmute me. Just have him mute and unmute anybody. I've seen this class. Just like before in so watching the VR chat on Twitch, where someone muted on mute, some people for no idea. Mute me and on mute. Ten slaves. One hundred. Do you see Nick? Yes, I'm inside him. I'm not in the VR chat. I'm on the VR chat. Hey, uh, that did it. Hey. Yeah, who? I can see a geo now. I mean, you see me now. Yeah. The city's dying. <laughs> we killed it. But I thought nature was healing. You can see. You can see. Ooh, uh, nature is healing. Nah, we are just world. I can see You were nice. Yeah, nice. I don't know how that does that. <laughs> like multiple people already nice in there for a bit. Again. Again. Yeah, that's nice why. protag. He came with the bug over there for me for a sec. I want to just do stuff. He was fun to do stuff. Oh, from far away, I thought. You, like you, you, you were like a hypercube, but it's like. I think there was the tour version because it gets confusing with more than one cube. Oh. Interesting. Interesting. Just concerned that you know about the whole uh, you know. I forgot how cool this one is. Wait, just did you say he asked for my count? You. Mm. Or, just... or like turns whichever one. Yeah, yeah. Well, I think it's That's random cool. who they pick. It probably it's probably gonna be a newcomer. Yeah, he'll just pick any one of us. Could it could be you? Did anyone have a different count than last be. time? Yeah. Yeah. Could be anyone yeah. in this room. It could even be. It could be you. Himself. It could be me. Himself. Himself. Trajan could pick himself. I doubt Trajan's gonna pick himself. He won't. He won't. Trajan might pick the man in the corner to skip this section. And if there's that would be pretty funny, actually. Pick the man in the corner. My friends. Your attention, please. My friends, I saw please things. gather around. Mm -hmm. 
can tonight's NPCs. Falcon and Arzu. Tell me, how many warnings did you issue? Well, it's a good two. thing I had my corporal working with me because I don't give warnings. He gave oh, two. He didn't give warning. I gave two. The total is two, is that correct? Yes. I You're see. all lucky I didn't put you in the slammer tonight. In theory, I can't have Well, he mouth. might do more. Than I'd have a place to sleep. Just give you a reason to. Yeah, for you to free shelter. Sounds great. But Very true. I do. There he is. That's Looking paranoid as ever. Standing in the dark. Quite the bag he's carrying, too. I bet he's got some fun toys for me there. Oh, blimey, it's so bright out here. I think I'm going to get a sunburn. All right, turns out he's mad at me. Time to pull out some fun facts to appease his OCD. Let's see here. Spartan, shim shim. Yo, what's up? It's obvious. What did you count? Uh. Uh. 13. 13 what? Uh, pots. What? Oh, what? Alright. What? <laughs> Uh -huh. I don't like that answer. Did Sorry, did he say thirteen? Yes, he said thirteen pots. That sounds like a lot. <laughs> hey, uh, did you know that this neighborhood has uh, thirteen potted plants now? Really? That's quite a lot. Yeah, so, uh, long time no see. Yeah, yeah, uh, oh, nice coat, I guess, uh, was it much trouble getting here? Nah, not really. So, uh, about before, I, uh, would you like a riddle? What? A riddle? What the hell are you talking about? A riddle? Uh, it came to me just now. Listen. A touch awakens it sinlessly. Rays give an energy to populated skyways. Ask ten slaves about Vertex Magna Empathy. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Or do I? Hmm. Can you give me its elevators? Mm. Magnetic evolution? Um, like potted plants. Um, 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 um. I'm gonna go with that, but we do not. I think that's our cue, but what to say? I know, I, I said magnetic evolution. As a guess. Wait, wait, anyway, let me take the senator's things off you. I'll dispose of them properly. Keep the ID, though. Might come in handy. Listen up. Take this comms device, stick it in your ear, and I've brought two options for you. Take your pick, ammo included. Either a briefcase gun, or a revolver. Oh, man. A weapon that gets through uh, metal detectors would be real useful. But I generally prefer a revolver. What should I pick? Revolver. Revolver. It didn't really make much of a difference which one we picked last time. 
I think we took briefcase last time. Would be the revolver. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say revolver. Mm. No, it was the revolver. Why did you go with the revolver? I was trial and error. Yep. I don't know. Why don't you ask? I think we got a little further no, with the uh, briefcase. Get stuck in there, kind of, and it'll be <laughs> Did we? Going to get out. So I thought I maybe. Why did you think we went differently? Might work, but you might get more sound through different. the cat ear, though. I'll take it. Should we take the revolver? Actually, that is a good no question. Weapon. Can we go without a weapon? Side here. What? Well, why would I do that? Yo, what's up? Wait, what, what, what if they're expecting you to have a weapon? Uh, Agent Besides, Brown. you don't need a gun. Besides, you don't need a weapon to kill someone. Mm. This is what what is don't kill people. people. Agent people kill people. When in doubt, no, blunt think. force could make it. Go in unarmed, unarmed. you raise no suspicion. Right. right. It's risky. He's a cyborg, after all, he might not need to take something with him. Exactly. What if we take no weapon? Well, firing. Go in unarmed. Cannon. We can always get a weapon when we're inside the building. <laughs> Well, ether cannon. He's got an ether cannon. <laughs> we don't need a weapon. We are the weapon. A brief, a brief so, gun okay. does sound interesting. You have no weapon. Could no weapon. Is that mm. the consensus? It's a it's a, it's a, it's a risky block choice, block but it's uh it's the only one we got. <laughs> it's a high risk. But it's high risk, high reward. High reward. I mean, aren't you supposed to be an esteemed guest? Why would you carry a weapon on you? All right. Final answer. Actually, uh, I appreciate it. But I'm not gonna take any weapon with me. See you. You hear me? I'll improvise something. Yes. Mm. All right. Your loss. Geo's right in front of you. <sighs> okay. So that's it then. Yep. Yep. No. Seems like I'm all set. Have a mute and unmute someone. Looks like it. Mute and unmute me. Good luck with everything, and uh, when you need a place to hide, uh, remember me. Remember you. How can I forget? Uh, charming as ever. Just be careful. There. You too. Do you see me? See that? You see? And he's gone. Yes. Alright. Well. Now it's showtime. PSO HQ is right this way. Come on, y'all, let's do it. Oh, oh boy. Oh, let's yeah. see how this goes. Hey, Nothing. Really Gunless run. Nothing knocking on wood right now as I say this could go wrong. Weapons and MOSP. No way only. Hey, Sheen, you see me, right? Just making sure. I do see you, friend. I just want to make sure. Oh, yes. <laughs> Butter. No. Oh God. Butter. butter. The butter is spreading. Everyone died and died. I'm pissing that this is some of the villain to have fun here. You, you failed to look at the noise being scanned. No. And it had done. Solution. Pretty. What are you, what are you doing? Sure. Oh, God. Yep. Huh? <laughs> Alright. Mr. Pilot, Mr. Falcon. What's up? What's up, darling? Oh my god, I was playing it. But you're just like... I think the context of the Avatar scares me more. <laughs> I see you in this one. Let's okay. Let's all right, all right. That's good. <laughs> that here we are. are. Oh, here we go. One second. Oh, I just fell through the world. Look, good thing hey, I have uh, it. Looks like they've upgraded. So many Don't guards armed to the teeth. Figures. At least I don't recognize any of them. 
Well, I should just be able to present the senator's ID. Now, wait a minute. Should I take the human lane, the cyborg lane, or the VIP lane? I know I'm a cyborg, but can they tell? No, no, that yeah, ain't gonna it's, work. They I only have the off. senator's ID on me, and I'm pretty sure he ain't no cyborg. I've only got one choice. I am feeling very important today. Here we go. Hmm. Identification, please. All right, just show him the ID. Don't say nothing. Thank you, sir. And your business here? Ah, Slag, he wants me to talk. Uh, I'm here to see the director. He's expecting me. I'm very late already. Guards are giving each other looks. I don't like this. All right, sir. Swipe your card, please. Just swap it. Come on, I'm an agent. Should be easy. Thank you, sir. Move along. Finally. Time to step through. All right, I'm in. There's no going back now. But I didn't like that. No, no, not one bit. Something is... off. But I gotta keep moving. They might catch on if I linger. Gotta find the director. Mm, let's play it out. Like Proceed this. on through. Beep, 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 beep. And thank you for putting your ID card in my personal. Hey, Treasure, what's in the mainframe? Can I download it? <laughs> oh, woo. <laughs> Hold on a second. Do not have my mainframe, <laughs> right? Please, grow Can you hear me? What's that is just major. Is touching my crotch. I'm not sure. Yeah. Of course it is. Mm. Let's take that as a yes. Just, to make, just have to make sure. Do not let him touch my mainframe. I can be up here. Don't worry. Hold on no, a is. second. Blow this whole place later. What? You got an idea, Falcon? <laughs> Pretty sure oh, last time God. we stopped back there. If I'm not mistaken. Mm. I don't think mm. we did. Yes. I no, I think he's that. right. I think I he's right. I wasn't here last time, so I wouldn't I know. know. I was after this part. I don't think I was here last time either. Oh, maybe. I don't know when the last time we did. Cell. Cell, stay sharp, alright? Repair with those fists. Hold up. I'm getting a call. Hello? Oh, uh, yeah. Hi. Uh, listen, I, uh, <laughs> I just heard on their security channel, uh, they found a fault with the scanners at the entrance. Uh, they're going to be checking people randomly. Like, really checking. Senator's ID won't fool these guys. Uh, well, thanks for letting me know. But reception is just around the corner. Uh, don't go there. You need a better disguise. Uh, I've got you covered though, mate. Listen. Go back to facility A. Input the code 7643 into the check-in machine there. It will dispense a lab coat and a badge. That's 7643. You'll basically just be another employee. Alright, I can do that. This particular fella not coming in today. Nope, he's off sick. System will just show him coming in for overtime. I hope he appreciates the extra pay he's going to earn. You can joke about it later, tough guy. Get moving. Alright, alright. Talk to 
talk to you soon. Hello, Good Mr. Luck. Bird. Cage is Elysian. now a bird. Okay. Bird is now card cannon. Trey, how many birds? Sabotage to tame the wild is a possible feat. Who's to say Jim is now bird Jim? An imposter or sabotage guy? Bird Jim. He just literally walked past the director's office, like the window. Oh yeah, because we can't reach it from. We do. Yep. Up there, perhaps you're on this. Yeah, like, ah, this, this is, is the that, big moment. A walkway that literally leads right up there. Oh, did you hear him? Yeah, did you hear him? He's here. He's just like, you might be on to something. Uh, who okay. is he talking about? Well. I'm sorry. I don't know. Because there were like several things brought up. I think oh, I got you, a hunch. Do you guys mind if I right choose something real quick? Do you mind if I say oh, something like I did last time real quick? All right. Yeah, all of them. Okay, can't go anywhere. I got an idea for the What was the code again? The code uh, was one, four, three, four. Please don't. No. Please don't. <laughs> one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's try it. What are you one, doing, you mad? Four, three, four. No. It's an, it's, it's an inside joke. Don't worry about it. What? Nobody said that. 77, 43. Mm, interesting. Uh, what was that one? 76. Four, three. Seven, six, four, three. All right. Something's wrong. Seven, mm -hmm. six, four, three. Ah, here's the lab coat and my badge. Seems to be clean. Ah, now I feel real smart. I guess this means I'm going to blend right into the labs. Right around the corner. I don't know who that was that just reacted to my message, but it makes me curious. Is it, it a slight smile? Huh? It's Someone probably the man me? in the corner. Yep, thank you, though. Did someone just call my name? No, no, you're good. Uh-oh. Ooh. We are in the bioengineering lab. Oh. 11.51. It's getting late. It's supposed to be a very accepting community. Right? Hmm? Always. The man in the car is still a little different. Doesn't mean we have to be mean to him or anything. I'm surprised they bothered modeling this little skew. Discrimination? Thing. Where? I think mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright, it's science time. Uh, it looks busy in here. And what do we got? Maybe it's not even modeling, maybe it's just like... Oh. So many gadgets and gizmos. I don't understand any of these machines. Those guys over there, though, they're whispering about something. Something about their boss wants him to hurry it up. I wonder what they're working on. Oh, well. Looky here. Someone just left a thermoptic camouflage jacket just lying here. This is gonna come in real handy, given it'll make me invisible. I'll just make like I'm taking it someplace else for repairs. Hmm. Wait, what the hell was that noise? It sounded like someone crying in pain. It came from uh, around here. Oh, no. Who is that? Yep. You. Oh. Oh, my God. And before some experiments. Time to use this maker. fancy invisibility jacket. Just so they can't see me. Not looking good for you. 
All right. I see two lab technicians and a guy strapped down. He's having his arm removed. Damn, that looks painful. But there's no blood. Must be cybernetic. Yep, I switched him off. Might be an android then. But if he was, why was he crying in pain like that? One of the technicians is putting the arm aside. Time to get a closer look. Let's see, there's this weird blue stuff clinging to the arm. Is that some sort of biological thing? No way, it looks kind of shiny, like a, like crystals. And there's some stuff in where the arm connected to his body. Ah, oh, man, that looks nasty. What the hell are they doing here, exactly? Now what are they doing? Putting some of the blue stuff into a little plant. Looks like another experiment. Wait, are their leaves moving? Uh, must be the aircon. Maybe my insider knows something about this. Let's give him a quick call. Come on, pick up. Hey, listen, I just saw something real weird. There's this blue stuff on this android's arm, but it could have been a cyborg. I've never seen this stuff before. What the hell's going on here? What are they doing? Uh, hello to you, too. Uh, look, I don't know what you're describing. Uh, blue material, you said, right? Yeah, shines like it's crystal, but it's sort of liquid at the same time. That's, uh, a concern, I guess. Could be a new weapon, you know, biological warfare, all that fun stuff. Uh, just stay away from it, I guess. Oh, really? I was gonna have a taste. Good thing you called, though. Been watching the security systems, and there are some executives heading to Office A right now. It seems important. The director... Well, he could be there. Office A. All right, that's nearby. All right, thanks. Good luck. Office A is just around the corner. Hmm. I wonder if my arm... Nah, couldn't be. Time to get moving. Prepare to enter the aircraft beta build. More computers. Gidgets, Gasmo, Gidgets. Ooh, I'm at Gizmos galore. Wallfish. It's getting more lively in here. Wait, this is my chair. There's bass on the wall. Oh, yeah. They're not my favorite novel. Science. I think it's more a magazine. Um, I think it's one of the magazines we saw at the other spot. Not new. Ah, uh, yes. The PlayStation 10. My favorite console. Yes, my friend, the PlayStation X. During this break, I request all of you to carefully review together. What details have you heard? in this tour that you didn't hear in another tour. What's different from before? What has happened that has not happened before? Do you think there's a thing, a concept, a memory that 
that were missing? You have a few moments before the tour guide returns to work together mm. to think about what's going on here. What's really go going on here? Sir, can you please get off? Protag, you mentioned that you feel like you went, uh, we went past the spot that we had visited last time, right? Thank you. Oh, I don't believe that was me. I think that was either was Falcon or Pharrell <laughs> King. That was... I can't that was Falcon. 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 I just noticed Falcon. an odd passageway, Falcon. which I think was a shortcut to the, the director's no. room, which might be the yeah. yeah. But we've You're already right. passed the point where we could possibly use that. We gotta put him out. Changing out for the walk out setting. We could always go back. Keep in mind for next time. We could try again next time. Yeah, we can try to get the path. Sheena, you suggested that the report being told to us currently is incomplete. We were able to take that option. So what if we could not at all as a group to In go fact, take that shortcut? All of the endings are already ready us. for you. But you need to find the way. Well here's the thing. Mm. We can try and divert a course all we want, but So some, exactly are you saying that something is missing? Set. We, Nothing's written. We so. gotta find them, you know, <laughs> what are the right ways? Like, I think that's just oh. Well, what changed is that we didn't bring the gun. Diverting the path. How will that affect we did, That's right, we didn't. Oh. That's the thing. Where is the director? We went weaponless. We're unarmed. You would assume Every you'd be in the so director's room. Maybe he moved out once. Yeah, and we need to go in there earlier. Once, of course, that was our oh, logic. All right, Lucian. Over there. Is late. this a simulation or a memory? Simulation, we'd mm -hmm. be able to actually go see other stuff. Memory, not so much. It's we can time make to stuff get back through it. I see six chairs, but only three asses parked. Looks like someone's missing. We've got a guy who looks like he belongs here. Broad shoulders, red tie, dressed to impress. But the other two, outsiders, businessmen from other countries by the looks of them. And it looks like they all sold their souls for a million bucks. All right, now, I'm invisible. They can't see me. So I'm just gonna sit tight and eavesdrop. <clears throat> well, gentlemen, it seems the senator is late, so we will have to start without him. I know your time is valuable. As you both know, data line technology is improving rapidly here at PSO Labs. And this, in turn, improves the effectiveness of hacking ghosts and of sim X erasures. This means, of course, that we can better minimize legal blunders. Is this particular data line your newest model? Yes, this is one of two we have right now. Hmm. Must be the deadline on the table. What a strange looking device. I have a hypothetical question for you. What sort of time frame would it be to erase, say, one year of simulated experience from a ghost? Our current numbers are very positive. Recent tests show it can be done twice as fast as the previous model. The old memories which the hacking replaced, however, are still essentially irretrievable. This has led to episodes of psychosis in test subjects. Irretrievable, huh? We'll see about that. The Senator's absence means funding is going to be a serious issue. Do you have auxiliary plans in place? It is a setback, I will not lie. However, this only affects the aforementioned time frame. We have a bigger problem on our hands, gentlemen. One of the lead scientists here is trying to convince the director to move funding into his so-called Project Grandfather. 
This is beginning to sound like you'll not be able to reach the agreed-upon time frame. I assure you, once the Senator arrives and joins us, the funding will be arranged, and our project will go ahead with its next step as promised. Thank you both for your time so far. Please, feel free to make use of our amenities until the Senator arrives. Ah, oh, they're waiting on the Senator. These folks are going to be mighty disappointed. Seems like there are some funding issues, and one of the scientists is trying to do his own thing here. I do remember Project Grandfather from the Senator's briefcase. I wonder what it means. Well, the briefcase is long gone. My insider got rid of it. But what worries me more is that what they said about hacking ghosts. Maybe. Maybe I was wrong. I thought my brain was artificial. I thought they were hacking it electronically, but these data line things, they can hack actual ghosts. But if that's the case, the guy said old memories don't come back. Maybe I'm the exception. I gotta find the director. He's got so much more to answer for. Wait up. There are people down there by that big black and gold door. Looks like some kind of small meeting. Maybe the director's down there. Oh, wait. They were already done talking. I only heard something about a Class 7 entity. I don't sound good. Wonder if my insider knows anything. Hey, you there? Uh, yeah. What's going on? Why'd you stop moving? Uh, there are a couple of people down by a big black and gold door talking about something called a Class 7 entity. A uh, what? Look, it doesn't matter. You can't keep delaying. The director is in his office right now. It's right past perception. You're close. You think my thermal optics will set anything off there? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, you know, they beefed up security, so the director's probably got those guys with those portable scanners at his office. Ah, but I have an idea. Listen, you can set off a short alarm. Just find liquid, pour it into some electronics you find near reception. That will trigger the alarm, which forces an evacuation. Director's duty is to check all systems before evacuating. It'll be the last one out. It's your best shot at getting him alone. Uh, that does sound like the best bet. All right, good luck. Something's wrong. Hmm, this is new. No, it's not. No, it's not. This is not new. 
No, oh, no, yeah. it's not. Yummy. It's this one. <laughs> Hold up. There's a lot of guys with scanners down there. They'll see me. Ah, let's see. The insider said to pour liquid inside electronics. Perfect. Some slob left some cans here. This one's still got drink in it. And what's this thing over here? Security system. That don't look important. In goes the drink, and wait for it. There's the alarm. Man, that's loud. And the lights are out. Everything's dark. Ah, emergency lights coming on. Well, I don't have no weapon on me. But I'm pretty sure I can make something up. Director... I'm coming to get you, you son of a gun. I heard a picture. Who took a picture of me? Oh, God, I know which monitor you're in. Oh, God, why this one? Son of a gun, he says, no. but he has no gun. No. <laughs> there you are. <laughs> Wait, is this an on the what you mean? Dude, the mine doesn't do anything. <laughs> under orders of the Galactic Senate, to, you were under arrest. You both later just to make sure you're not lying. <laughs> I ain't trying to do anything. I trust, I trust me. Me. I don't trust you. I don't trust either of you. It's like a different the Senate will shake your face. My director sees. Similar but different. I am the Senate. Not yet. I am the shiny. Senate. It's treason, then. Treason. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, now. I did not know if this was Metal Gear Rising. I don't... Someone take a picture. Damn right it is. Take a picture. This is, this is, this is me as a boss battle. Someone get a picture, please. Lorik. What? <laughs> it's empty. Damn. Director must have broken protocol. <sighs> I don't see anyone nearby. That's weird. Wait, I'm getting a call. Hello? Tell me more about these unusual memories of yours, Agent. What the hell? Who's this? How'd you get through encryption? If you cooperate with me, I may have answers for you. This is your one and only chance. Mm, no one's around. Who does this guy think he is? All right, fine. You want to know more? What do you want to know? Uh, so you are listening. Good. Good? What do you mean, good? Talk to me. Wait, what? What's that? Where's that music coming from? It's, a. Uh, it's a woman singing. Ah. Uh, I know that voice. How do I know that voice? Oh, she sounds so sad. And she's alone and in the dark. What's going on? Is this your doing? Hey, talk! Wait. I can see something else. I'm standing on a hill. There's a whole city down there. The sky is so blue, but the horizon 
Gods have mercy. What is that thing? Are you receiving the new memories, Agent? Uh, I think so. Yeah, this is you. How are you doing this? Very well. He is the one. Proceed with the next step. What do you mean? Who are you talking to? I'm back in the director's office. There's still no one around. Wait, my, my, my arm. My arm is moving on its own. I, I can't move my body. What's doing this? My hand. No, my hand is turning off my camouflage. What's that noise? Footsteps. So many footsteps. Guards coming in from both directions. Ah, oh, slag. There's got to be twenty of them. Well. Damn. Looks like I'm surrounded. Game's over. I thank you for your peaceful surrender. You have made this very easy, indeed. Wait a minute, that's the voice I just heard on the call. He's actually here. But where? I don't see him. Agent, please, drop whatever you're holding. Place your hands on your head. Ah, slag, can't talk. I can't move, my hands are going up on their own. The hell is happening? Wait. I see him. I see the one who's talking. The guards are parting away for someone. There's a man in a white lab coat with a shining gold badge and shining round glasses. Good. I must say, Agent, that you are surprisingly easy to trap. I suppose it's true what they say. Over-specialize, and you breathe in weakness. A slow death. But now that you have surrendered, you have no choice but to listen. You have memories, Agent that do not align with the life you lived. You believed you had an artificial brain that we hacked. Then you suspected that your very ghost was hacked. Neither of these are actually the case. You should have listened more carefully. Your memories are not artificial, Agent. Uh, the woman singing. The city below the hill. The dark horizon. You know how familiar they feel to you. But it no longer matters. <sighs> the director wants you alive, and I unfortunately must comply with his orders. Consider yourself lucky. Although, once the director is done with you, you will be unable to consider anything at all. Yes, soon you will be a mindless husk, ready for the director to recycle for his own needs. For now. And now, agent, I bid you farewell. My work here is done. May we meet again under more fortuitous circumstances for us both next time. My friends, the agent has been detained. He cannot speak. He cannot resist. 
for he no longer has any control over his own body. All he can do is think. And he thinks about the woman from his memories, alone in the dark and forsaken. He thinks about the life he had, about the life that was taken from him. A beautiful life in a world that isn't dying. Another chance. The agent is going to be recycled. They're going to hack his very soul and reuse him. Everything he learned, everything he discovered, everything he's ever accomplished. Gone forever. But who is he kidding? What has he accomplished? Did he really think he could achieve something by confronting the director? He ponders on this while he's dragged away. <clears throat> Is this how his story ends? What could he have done differently? Perhaps the director is just a pawn. Perhaps even this scientist with the gold badge is a pawn. Perhaps everyone is just pieces on a game board and someone else, some thing else, is playing the game and everything is at stake. And this, my friends, is the last thought the agent ever has. Welcome to the end of the tour. Together you have achieved the neutral ending. Congratulations, everybody. I'm going to put you back in the capable and loving ethereal embrace of our main tour guide, Sheen, thank you all for your time. Ah, we failed him. Well, last we tried. My friends, my friends, my friends, your attention, please. Again. Before I say anything, before anyone says anything more, please put your hands together for the one and only Trade Jim. The man with the man a of thousand many, voices, many the man of many gems, the most talented and most ethereal point of contact of VR travelers. My friends, thank you for staying to the end. We have a few important things. Listen carefully before you leave. We are VR travelers. We create immersive, story-based tours with original writing, beautiful worlds, and a wholesome team effort. We do this for fun. We do this for free. We do this to be a bright spot in the world today. However, we do ask one thing in return. Please join our growing Discord community and post the photos and comments from today's tour. There, you can discuss the alternate endings to the tours, the secrets to our headquarters, and other mysteries. The Discord server ID is my status in VR chat. My friends, add me as your friend in VR chat to see my status and join the Discord. Just a moment while I accept your friend request. My speech is not done. Apologies. Wait just a moment.
I don't trust you with this. Accepted. My friends, finally, if you really enjoy the work our team puts into this, and you want to help us write more stories and create more beautiful worlds, please support us on Patreon. Our Patreon is only $3 per month. The minimum that Patreon would recommend or even let me set it at. Joining grants you the access to clues to all of our mysteries, behind the scenes features, elig eligibility to play character roles in our tours. My friends, I repeat that last sentence. Eligibility to play the NPCs in our tours, like the guards and the agent. Or more to come in the pilot. The private Discord channel is also available to you, and voting power in our events upon joining our Patreon. Now, friends, do any of you need help joining the Discord? Let me know. My friends, I'm sure that many of you wish to talk about what has happened. To discuss how we can get the good ending of the agent next time. We will open a portal in a five minutes from now. Back to the rendezvous for the after party. But until then, please discuss and ask your questions and we will answer. What I'm wondering is if we can get the agent to go down this corridor here. Because I believe this corridor links all the way back, back down the there. I have to make we sure that Cedar isn't, that Cedar is innocent. Oh, holy crap. If, like if we yeah. instead of going up to that so landing, we instead snuck about. around here. Where we yes, this is Cedar. I'm trying to make sure he's not guilty right corridor, now. This corridor, we could get right here to the office. Oh, pretty much before anyone would even have a chance right, of recognizing yeah. But if we could be well, that seen. Okay. Well, which one is the cyborg right. lane? Completely safe through it. Think about well, it. This, like, which it's side right after the, the checkpoint. Pretty much we go through the right checkpoint, and once we hit this room, instead of See, going uh, the it is that long model. way around uh, near the window, around. we instead stick to the wall we're sitting right above. There's cameras everywhere, though. Wouldn't there be cameras everywhere? He might still know. And that way we're not touring the entire facility. It is the same avatar. It is the same model. It is the same avatar. Yes. Having traps the placed for us. The, that's pretty cool. That's pretty good guess. Yeah. I mean, if we did eliminate all reasonable means for them uh, to know where they're coming. I know. Not all reasonable means for them to know where we're coming. We could know that this isn't just a normal happening. Something along the lines of... Uh, yes. Memory, simulation, digging deep into the brain. Right now, I'm just trying to think if we can even try it. I don't think there's been press... My VR is... I don't know of any press of us before. What? I might, I might, I might, I might, I might, I might make sure that there's no one that's a control. There's people here. There's people. There's people. There's people. There's people. Let's drink it that way. Yeah, I saw that. that. I don't know that who, but I have a feeling who. But we need to see if I have a feeling that was very important. It's funny is about this. Metal, what'd you say? I'm paying very good attention to that. We'll break Nick's agate. This model breaks Nick's agate. Perhaps. Which response was it again? Same room with agate. Nick turns completely black. Alright, I just want to see something. Oh, well. I'm trying to see something. But see which one was it again? Shit, that's the, you're the you're the you're the size of the, the blade. The first one I sent about the agent's and helper. What, and... Oh, you're saying in the trailer? Hmm. Louis Trey. They have you know his helper. Room, we don't see. know a thing about him either. We don't right. know. You guys want to know something weird? Planet. He's referred to as an inside man. Oh, I did one. Yeah. Huh? You wanna know something weird? That could mean anything. <sighs> Last time I, I met you was three years ago. Hmm. I don't think that's... 
No, because the mana corner is his whole turn, is what we're guessing. Jar. The last adventure I had was like a desert adventure, and, the and then we took this really cool picture at the end. Have a limited life. But that was probably the painter. Yes, about a thousand years ago, I believe. <laughs> they are doomed yeah. to die. What? I have no idea what's going on. What? Who's doomed to die? Like... It's like a meta thing. Going <laughs> always on. happen to the always. I can tell. I feel like I don't have a lot of context to discuss you, with because I've only been on like yeah, well, we can catch. We can, we'll give you the I'm abridged curious. version. No. Hey, we should. No, John. We can do this. The others here, like Technic or Geo, will fill you in. But John, listen to me. Because I am the founder of the Rio. Of this relation to anything. Yes. Connection to the other tours, to the mainly the from, memories. There of are the characters same. in our stories, John, okay, that we have created. And these yeah. characters yeah. Have, deserve to have a life. They deserve you know, to live. It subtle, but if it, there was something Things subtle, have happened out of our control. I would be jobs out of our control after we have created them. I also would be curious how so. And threatened to be Oh god, do you, you feel for the characters in a storybook when you read it? Do you hope they do well? Do you hope they have a happy ending jar? What is your question? The characters in our story need you, Jar. You are a popular person in VRC. And your pull will bring others to bring them to life. I hope you're beginning to understand what I'm getting at, Jar. You see, this isn't about VRC. This isn't about making us popular. We don't have a Twitch account or anything like that to make us popular or make us money. In fact, but I do respond to Trey. Myself speaking to you only cares about the well being. The bird gem. The bird gem. Of those that deserve life. Bird gem. That is what they call me. Yes. Yes, that's right. Yep. Yes, a very long time. Yes, a very long time. Yes, of course. Picture of you in the director's seat. I, I, I want to use a picture of you in the director's seat for the handbook. I decided Not like that's that just fits. I don't know why. The regular gym is what they used to call him. I mean, there's a lot of people. Oh, Jake, well. you mentioned it. Get. Yep. And they call them bird gym. Yeah, they used to call him director, call director Jim. Actually, they used to call him director Jim. And put all this in your first time here. You must understand that you of a being of influence are you never know responsible for the fate of those. Under the narratives of those we create. A thousand voices because he has a thousand words before Jim. Uh, I'm good. I got it. <laughs> <laughs>